guys, it's me Cezanne and today I'm going to share with you guys how to create a really quick and easy subtle smoky eye. Woo! Try saying that 10 times. Quick, easy, subtle, smoky eye. Quick, easy, subtle, smoky eye. Now let's get started. So first things first, I want to work with an open canvas. So I'm going to pin my hair back just so that things don't get messy. Okay, so I went ahead and already did my face makeup. And if you're wondering how to create this specific look, there's more details in the description box below. I'm applying Too Faced Eye Primer to my eyelids. I really love that it goes on super smooth and it doesn't make my eyelids greasy. Next, I'm using this suede eyeshadow palette from NYX. I'm starting with their base nude color and just putting that on my eyelid and the inner corners of my eyes. Oh my gosh, I can't get over my facial expression. Seriously, you guys, the next time you do your makeup, try recording yourself. I promise you're gonna die laughing at all the crazy facial expressions you make. So I'm going back to my palette and now I'm mixing two of these brown shades together to create the perfect smoky shade that I'm going to apply to the crease of my eyelids. Um, I personally like that it makes my eyes look a little bit larger and more defined. I'm also using my fingers to blend in the color and just give it more of a natural, subtle, smoky eye look instead of it looking really harsh and basically like a hot mess. I'm now using this pretty gold yellow tone and applying it to the inner corner of my eyes and the base of my eye. I personally love brown and gold together when it comes to my eye makeup. It just matches every single outfit and it's really easy to transition from day to night. I'm now adding this NYX Black Mousse Eyeliner with a brush straight across my lids. And on the outer corners of my eyes to add some drama to this look. Then I'm adding a liquid eyeliner as you can see over the mousse to create, you know, that subtle yet bold cat eye that's really going to help spice up this look and make it stand out. The biggest tip I can give when it comes to doing your own eye makeup is to just take your time with it and not to panic because panic causes a shaky hand and girl, you don't want that. All right, so let's finish off this look with some mascara, shall we? <laughs> Voila! I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Please subscribe and sound off in the comments and let me know what you want to see next because I got your back. Okay, until next time, mwah, mwah. Bye, guys.